Well, hey YouTube, this is Jerry. You know, I will kind of watch some of the prepper stuff and the bushcraft stuff, and what I find is they're really into these things called EDCs and tins, EDC tins, which is an everyday carry tin. So this is one that I made for because I'm a pellet gunner. So it doesn't have to be square. I made a round one, and inside comes with silica gel to keep things dry, 25 extra 22 caliber pellets. 10 feet of wire that uh, I can use for making snares or whatever. A fire starter, which Bic lighter will work better, but I have this now. A needle and thread with, I put a curved needle. I don't know if it'll show up, but we can try. It's got a curved needle in it because they're easier to stitch somebody up with. This is kind of my own invention here. This is uh, Strike Anywhere Matches mixed with uh, wood scrapings off of the matches. So it's basically sprinkle this on anything and hit it with a fire starter or a big lighter. And this torches up really fast. And then this is my own idea. This is gun wrap. And it's basically a self-sicking, stretchy um, ace bandage. I thought, man, this is the perfect tourniquet. Or if you break your arm, you know, and you need to support it, this work really good. So... Anyway, that's my idea. It all fits into my little um, pellet gun tin. And it actually fits really easily. I'm still going to put some other things in here. I want to put a, a little compass in, I think. A small, you know, a very small portable compass that works. And um, I think that's something that needs a, maybe a whistle. I, you know, I haven't seen very many whistles in the EDCs and stuff, but... Uh, I'm thinking a whistle might be a good idea. There you go. A little bit of tape around it and it's waterproof and there you go. So you don't have to have a, uh, a square um, tin. You can use a round tin, a triangle tin, an oblong tin, whatever. And it'll work just as good. Anyway, there you go. Let me know what you think. Jerry out. Keep on shooting.